Morning Gators. It's Friday, November 18th. I'm T. And I'm Brewer. And that's Stanley. We have a great show planned for you today. And to kick it all off, we have Ashlyn on how to get the Carson Scholarship. Hey Gators. I'm Ashlyn and I have news for you. Hey Gators, I'm Ashlyn and I have news for you. First, I have a few questions. Are you a freshman, junior, or a sophomore? Great, sorry seniors, we have nothing for you. Um, do you have at least a 3.75 GPA? Great. And lastly, do you want a $1,000 scholarship? Okay, great. It's called the Carson Scholarship and it was founded by neurosurgeon Ben Carson. You know, the guy who ran for president and yes. Well, yeah, all you have to do really is write a short essay and submit it to Miss, Mrs. Mills, our junior counselor, and you'll be set. You'll be set. Well, that's all for the news for yeah, bye. Wow, wasn't that incredible? Yeah, really great stuff. Hey Brewer, do you have any knowledge on college? Not a lick. Well then, let's go to Noah with more information on College Knowledge Night. Gators, if you're like me, you have no idea how to view in the college process. Thankfully, Captain Treep and some other local colleges teamed up to bring you guys College Knowledge Night. I went, and I'm here to bring you five tips for collegiate success. Tip number five is completing your FAFSA application. Without it, you won't be able to get money from the state for college, so it's kind of a big deal. Tip number four is figure out how you're actually going to pay for college, be it out of pocket, through scholarships and financial aid, or any combination of the three. Tip three is to actually find out where you want to go to college. The best way to figure this out is to take a visit to the campus and talk with any current or past students there. The second tip is finding out how much the college you want to go to costs. You don't want to apply and get accepted and not be able to pay for it. Finally, the most important tip is to actually apply with a quality resume and glowing recommendations. Don't be the kid who acts a fool in class because your recommendations will reflect your behavior. Overall, College Knowledge Night was a big help. I hope that some of you who couldn't make it learned something for these tips. For KGTR, I'm Noah. A Centenary and Captain Shrew production, directed by our own Heather Hooper, the epic tale of Romeo and Juliet. I'm Tom McKenzie and I play Romeo. Lilith Foley and I play Juliet. Well, you have the Montagues and the Capulets, um, and it's like a rivalry between the two families throughout the play. Romeo is in his relationship with a girl by the name of Rosalind. But she's kind of using him and it, they kind of go on and off and he's feeling like really upset. He's feeling pretty much like belittled because she's using him for his money and stuff. But later on he meets a lovely lady by the name of Juliet and uh, they sort of fall in love kind of like at first sight. And um, throughout the play you just see them um, get closer and closer and you see the fights between the families and there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of lovely moments, there's a lot of dramatic moments. Yeah, and um, what our director has done, Heather Hooper, she's set it in modern day and she's highlighted the violence that Shakespeare has written in the play and brought it back to our world because we do have all this violence going on. She kind of sheds some light on that and shows how uh, useless it is. If you haven't seen Romeo and Juliet, I strongly suggest you see it soon. Hey Gators, it's Adam here. I know you've been following that new trendy topic, the mannequin challenge. If you weren't at the pep rally, our football team put something together. Let's go check it out.
Impact is a fun church event for high schoolers that meets on Wednesday nights at Broadmoor Baptist Church from 7.30 to 8.30. Well, that's all for us today, Gators. Shout out to our sponsors, Broadmoor Baptist, Luke Akana, The Bird Family, Remington College, Janice Henderson, Barbara Merritt, Shay Thomas, Kylan Thomas, Malini Thomas, and Aria Thomas. Be sure to come to the JV Boys Soccer Game tonight at 5. And then, go ahead and head over to Marjorie Lyons Playhouse at 7.30 for Romeo and Juliet. And remember, if you're not absent today, hit that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. And that's all for us. I'm Tristan. And I'm Brewer. For, for KGTR. KGTR. Boom!